further intervention. Thank you for the excellent presentations on the issue, which is the fundamental underpinning of sustainable development. My name is Kekusha Basu, and I'm speaking on behalf of the Major Group for Children and Youth. I want to briefly highlight the Major Group for Children and Youth's position on the proposal for a High Commissioner for Future Generations, which is the first recommendation in the UN Secretary General's report on intergenerational solidarity and the needs of future generations. We are working to ensure a meaningful follow-up to this report. The long term is such an important issue that we believe it, it requires a dedicated body to give it the visibility it deserves in order to orchestrate responsibility towards future generations. It would advocate for intergenerational equity in UN activities concerning sustainable development and encourage responsibility towards future generations in order to safeguard their interests from present threats. It would be the long-term voice at the table where everyone is preoccupied with immediate targets and achievements. We emphasize that this institution would be an independent office, purposefully small in size in order to not be a financial drain and not to bring more bureaucracy to the sustainable architecture, but rather to a streamline policy making, ensure smart decision making, and ensure effective and applied understanding of the long term. It is by design cross-cutting and cross-disciplinary, drawing on expertise and collaboration from other agencies, much in line with how the high-level political forum should be orchestrating sustainable development. Yesterday's morning moderated dialogue from Rio Plus 20 to post-2015 repeatedly emphasized that sustainable development it's not a zero-sum game. This also applies more specifically to future generations. A high commission for future generations could help identify win-win pathways that benefit both current and future generations. Not caring for future generations, on the other hand, is a lose-lose situation. Short-sightedness short harms both current and future humankind. Thank you. Uh, thank you very much. We have exhausted our speakers, and what I'd like to do is to try to uh, to get uh, some discussion going. And we're still open 